Well, hello there, everybody. So, fortunately, uh, wasn't exactly having a good time last night. And, uh, I didn't start on my scheduled time like I had planned. So, we are going to carry it on today. Um, I'm going to do a, like, freebie Friday. I might be going through, uh, quite a few different games, so... <clears throat> um... I'm not gonna change it. Like, change the, uh... Game titles or nothing. We're just gonna stay on just chatting. Um... But, so what I'm going to do for the whole freebie Friday thing is I'm going to go through my uh, Steam wish list and then probably browse the store a little bit. And I guess pick out a couple different games to play for, uh, for a little while that are just free games. Um, just looking at my list real quick. I only have a few on here. I'm going to try not to do anything that's like really too in-depth starting so I guess let me see here can I create groups on here my collections yeah sure All right, so what are we looking at first? I think my first option right here is uh, hmm, Smithworks probably. That is going to be our first one. I have also been looking at a game called Split or Steel. <clears throat> so we will check that out as well. Yep. Totally agree to everything. Uh, what is Cycle Frontier? PvPVE Extraction Shooter. Oh, let's see. Might be a little bit too in depth for what I'm looking for right now. All right, what do we got on the store? By the way, if anybody is watching at this moment, um, feel free to send me any recommendations. Uh, like I said, right now I am only looking for freebie games for the freebie Friday, since I unfortunately missed that yesterday. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. Categories. Free to play. Hmm. Shadowverse. Roar of... Ooh. Hmm. Let's try this one out also. Uh, what am I at here? I don't care about that right now. What's my connection looking like? It's looking like it's not bad at all. Perfect. So we are at three games for now. I cannot do anything VR related because I do not have uh, I do not have a VR system. All 
I'm also not looking for anything that is, um, how do I want to put it? Um, massive, massively played. I don't want to play anything like that either. Some really like weird off the wall something or other would be cool. just put that on there so we're not going to I also could add games that I have played already um, Realm of the Mad God is one of them but I could play that as well looking at this going back to RuneScape would be a relatively nice idea too I haven't played that in forever What else do we have on the list? Super Animal Royale? Nah. I'm also not looking for any uh, idle games at the moment either, because I know they'll just take forever. That one is 18 bucks, and for some reason it is in the free to play. Where are my categories here now? So I can do that one. Where are the ones I just downloaded? That one, that one, that one. Okay, that'll work for now. So I got four. Um, I have Bauer, Shadowverse, Smithworks, and Splitter Steel. Um, I will continue to look through the free-to-play games or whatever later on. But I think we are going to... Uh, we're going to start off with Smithworks just to check this out. From what I understand, you are a blacksmith. Um, it also says Cooperative Multiplayer. So I don't know how that would affect like single player versus multiplayer stuff. Let me double check and make sure this is going to work properly first. And then, uh, then I will switch over my camera. So let's see if this is already on here or not. Um, there we go. Should be good to go. Oh. I don't know why it does that. All right. Complete tutorial first. Now, tutorial. Let's move, look the mouse. Jump, and you escape, focus on F. Okay. Um, tutorial shouldn't be a problem. Uh, 
Hey. Hi. Huh? Oh, why is he on the other side of the... So he wants to have a... Axe and a hammer? Well, two ores to get one Inga. Yeah. place it somewhere or is it just stuck here I guess I'm just throwing it there can I just like chuck these in here I pick up more than one. That's not what I wanted to do. Well, I guess I got two hammers. Whoops. Making another ingot. That the, how do I get up there? Who in the world organized this blacksmith? What are you supposed to do with that anyway? Like that ain't even functional. Same day blacksmithing, huh? Okay. Hey. Huh? So, two ores in here. And 
one mace. This one can go up here. I want that. Then I just need to wait for my lead. <clears throat> So we have, let's see. I'm gonna have this on this side. This on this side. Yeah, perfect. Three stars for it. However, I have no idea what they're going to use it for. Do I actually have to join someone? I can't just like... Oh, I guess I can do a private one. We're gonna do a private one, try something out. Maybe we'll come back to this one when I actually have like some people to play with. Hold on, give me a minute. I will be right back. I have quick company.
Okay, carrying on. Sorry about that, guys. Um, the uh, Madre mother came by to uh, see how things were going and uh, drop a vehicle off. So, obviously had to talk to her for a little bit. Um, okay. Do I have... Do I have sound in here? Yes, I do. Back to Smithworks. What do we got here? Guild has just acquired a brand new shop, but it's a bit of a fixer-upper. Okay. Uh, there's still equipment yet to be installed and new supply chains to be established, but that isn't stopping local adventurers from putting in orders. We'll supply you with the ingots and leather. Just do your best. Okay, so it looks like as I do, a good, can, uh, can I earn like nine stars total on this? Is that how that works? Or is it just, yeah, well, we'll see what happens, I guess. Take a look at the manual first. Why? I don't want to. Smithing 101. Complete orders to get points. Speedy blacksmiths get extra points. Or at least an accuracy of 50% will be accepted. Weapon components can connect in many different ways. Detach and remove components at the ends first. Okay, so we have a sharpening stone, work or workbench for leather. And I think it looks like that's really all I need to do. Can I put this? Okay, I'll just put it right there. Shop is open for business. Hey. Huh? Harry, what do we have? So that is leather. Oh, where, where is... I should have should have looked this stuff up first. Where's where's my tanning thing? Okay, there's that. Where's 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 my Does does it matter I guess? I don't need to tan that first. Jump down. Nice. That is, that sounds like a lady. Okay, so they're providing leather and iron ingots. That's what they're doing. Fall damage. Where's my iron? Where's iron? Leather? Leather? Iron? Where are you? Where's my iron? Supply. Wow, what a place for that. Alright, 60%? What do you mean? Why'd I get a 60%? Okay. That's gonna have 
that in it. Add the iron, which is I'm gonna want that. Drop that now. That, that, good to go. Nice, one hundo. So I got four ninety eight on solo. Okay, so I do have a option, I guess, to get nine. Oh, I'm only going to be able to play a couple of these, or like three levels of this anyway. Smelter and tanning racks are now up for business. Well, excuse me, copy. Okay, level two. Up to you to process materials before assembly this time around, so teamwork is greatly encouraged. Remember, the leather should be the only thing left out to dry. Huh? What does that have to do with anything? Let's see, what do we got here? Oh, dang. Hold on one second, gotta send this message real quick. All right, I'm gonna check where everything is first. So we have, okay, perfect, iron's right there, tanner's right there, same thing. Cool, all right, open for business. Hey, yeah. Uh. Huh? Make that so, what do we got? Another? Another? And come on. Going all the way up here. Another one, and up we go. So it's gonna be like this, and like this. Perfect, one hundo. Uh, 
that and the other one. We'll make our straight piece. Alright. That's gonna be like that. These are the weirdest weapons, guys. Like, I... I don't know exactly, like, what they're gonna be able to do it with. Hey. Two of those, two of those. that thing. Trust. What is that one? Hallowed Nova. Is there anything else that I can? Is it just hats? What? All right, well, either way. No, 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 cancel. Number three. Oh, I guess I can do. Oh, never mind. I can do Ollie solo. Well, we'll make it through the first three levels at least, anyway. Fully equipped smithy means customer standards have risen. Now clients can order any weapon they desire. What's the difference? What's the difference? What do you mean by any weapon? Like, I've already done, like, dagger... Spear, like... I don't know. We'll figure it out. Alright, so let's check this out at least anyway. So uh, I still have my raw leather here, iron right there. I got an anvil. What does the anvil do? Iron handguard, hammer, mace. Oh. Okay. Nothing else? Perfect. 
So I guess what I'm going to do is, oh, I, of course I have to open up the shop first. What is this? Hey. Uh -huh. Oh, that is a goofy thing. Three of those, one piece of leather. A dagger and a hilt will be... Uh, we'll do that. Go up here, do the... Get the dagger all set. Last one is the mace. So I think that one is. Come on. I think that one is up here as well. And my leather for a straight handle. Okay, so hilt, handle. Check here. And dagger. Okay, next. Hey. Huh? Ooh, one, two. Like this, we'll go make a dagger right away. Alright. This one. I think I need one piece of leather, so we'll go over here. I just need to make the plush shaped handle. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. What are we doing now? I have 18 seconds to make this thing? That ain't gonna happen. Uh oh. Uh oh. Come on. Well, what, what, what is it that you want? Dagger, two maces, two handles, hammer. Dagger, well. It's only to make the maces, so those will come from over here. At least this one will be quicker. I think I only need to make one straight handle as well. Let's say goofed up at another one. Yeah, so how does this thing go? Um have a mace, handle, hammer. I need a hammer. So that's gonna be hammer, mace, handle, 
off. Dagger. What is this contraption? Man. 375? I could, uh, if I, if I got that second one or it was faster on the first one, I think I would have been fine. What I got? That was level three? Hmm. Hmm. Very tempting. Very tempting. All right. Let's go at it again. I think I'm going to go with a slightly different strategy this time. What is this thing? I don't think I'm meant to do that. Get some of this stuff going right away. Two daggers, perfect. Goofed up. It's all right. I'll just have a dagger for next time. Okay. So how does he want this thing? He wants this like this, with this on top. One dagger here. One dagger here. I'm gonna go and stretch that leather. And he wants an axe, a dagger, and a spear. So what we can do, I already got the dagger. So we take this one, make a spear. sword, whatever that is, and plus and a straight handle. for a design now. So you want to have um, that there, that here, 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 like so. Yep. All right. wants a lot of stuff. Alright, one, two, three, four, five. It's one straight handle. Got the hilt, hammer mace. Hammer. Take 
take our leather, go make our straight piece. This is the longest path. And then he also wants another hammer and a spear. And I just gotta put it together. So we have this, and we have a hammer underneath. Uh, yeah, I know he's waiting. Mace. Hammer. Help. Okay. Perfect. I can see how this is going to become multiplayer. Solo, 425. Ooh. I need I needed 200 on the first one, 275, 375, 425. Okay, what do we have for level four? I'm not gonna play this one yet. I'm probably gonna end up switching over to a different game. We now allow our customers the option to place generic orders. Blacksmith is given the freedom to choose a weapon structure so long as it meets the customer's requirements. Ooh, customization. All right. Well, that was definitely interesting. I might have to bring this one up to one of my buddies at some point, but let's uh, switch over for a minute. While I close this. I do like that one though. That one is going to be a little different. Also managed to get four achievements while I was doing that. So I took 25 orders from the customers. Um, I, I got the crash landing achievement for fainting from falling down too far, starting a game, and getting three stars on any level. It was really easy to do. Uh, let's see, what do we got? How about they move on to Bauer now? What do we have? I'm kind of curious about this one. Fly more than 500 meters in any game mode. More than a thousand meters. Stuck in a tree. Pass three penguins, pass one airliner, beat the dev's high score, and get three near misses. What is the dev's high score? Swap over to this one. Can I? I guess I'll do this for now. Loaded right away, perfect. Today I finally finished building it. All I have to do now is learn how to something or other. What am I doing? Options? No? Stars? I have played... I, I, I have played this one on Relax before. But I don't remember how to play. I think this one we're gonna go achievement hunting on. Because there's only... I think it was like seven? Something like that. Keep it out relaxed though. So space and control and an up and down arrow. There 
get what, 500 meters or something I said? Well, Yep. Come on. One penguin. No. Ow. Really? Eight meters away from the first achievement. Oh, restart. Come on. I should have boosted. Be lame. Can I just cheat it? the bottom like one penguin come on we got this what do we got or 40 something nice What, three penguins? Take us nice, calmly. We'll be fine. Oh. Master of Voyager. What was that one for? Past three penguins. Hmm. Okay. So that's number two. 902 was our best so far. We'll get this one. This one, this one, like I said, I think is gonna be an achievement hunt. Or trophy hunt. It's gonna be close. So, number two. Okay, so quick drop. Do I change colors every single time that I boost or not? Try the other direction. What if I go up? Whoa. Whoa. That was a mistake. Yep. Don't worry about it. I'll go down. Oh, not down like that far. Come on. Okay, there's my number three spot. No, oh, you penguin. Why are these penguins flying anyway? I think I like the bottom better. Come on, Bauer. You got this, buddy. Maybe not. Spoke too soon. Just 
swear, why am I having such a difficult time with this? What happens if I'm like, there's engine sputter out? Very calmly. Stay on the bottom. Yep, it's fine. I got this. I think I can go down just a little bit. Make sure nothing gets in my way. 99, come on. I'm so close to that. I was so close to that thousand. Oh. Is that just for landing in a tree? Ah, yeah, it gets stuck in a tree. I'm gonna pass one airliner, fly more than a thousand feet, beat the game or dev's high score in any game mode, and three near misses. I have no idea what is considered a near miss. That's not an ear mess. Stick to the bottom again. Like, how close does a person need to be for a near miss? Ooh. Oh! Well, there's the near misses. I see how that works. If I avoided that third one, though, I would have been fine. Ah, what? Man, the boost on the bottom, come on. Bottom is my friend. No, it's not. The bottom is my friend. That little chicken was not. All right, so shall we go for near misses? What? Come on. So what exactly warrants a near, uh, I still don't understand what exactly warrants near miss. Is that like if I played chicken with one of these birds or something or what? Come on, Bauer, you got this. Come on, buddy. Learn how to fly that thing. I guess we're, I guess we're gonna try and go for a thousand feet first, or a thousand meters first. Where did you come from? Oh, they're rocket-powered penguins. Up. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
Come on. Come on, Bauer. You gotta learn how to fly, buddy. We can do this. Really? 38 meters. I, I gotta watch that again. Did I even hit that one? Up? Barely. Barely even hit it. Hit boxes. Horrid. Is there. Yeah. Did he get scared and dive bomb me, or what happened? meters or three meter misses. Come on. Okay, there's one near miss. I didn't get one on that one. Whoa, whoa, out of control. Game is frustrating me already. Just want to get just just one more achievement. Just one more. Come on. Attention to peg one. Awesome. somewhere that wasn't a near mess oh 
Oh, I thought that was gonna be enough. What did he even do? Okay, there's one. We got this. We can do this. That wasn't one. That wasn't one either. Am I just like not pressing something fast enough or? Also not what I want to do. Three near misses. All right. Not boosting, we're not doing anything. What did I hit? Okay. That's considered near miss. That was almost two. Threading the needle. Okay, we're getting there. Does it have to be head on? Try and get one or the other. Either three near misses or a thousand meters in one go. Unless I get really really lucky and get both of them at the same time. I have a feeling the near misses is probably going to be the hardest one. Because the hitbox and the near miss is so close to each other.
Oh, okay. That was totally my fault. Come on. I wanna go up. I wanna like try and get more stuff in my way. We'll get this eventually. It's just, it's just gonna take some time. That is not what I wanted to do. What a shame. Come, come on. Well, first ones were good runs, and then after that, just straight shambles. Come on. Give me the opportunities. Not like that. That didn't even give me, like, the slow-mo. Like that. That kind of gives me slow-mo. If I want to try something different, if I want to do things to avoid... What's, what's the difference here? What's the other option? So is it just like dark? Relaxed. Okay, we got one. I, 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 I went to go down. I didn't even try to do anything on that one. down. Saddle. Saddle down. Help. Nope. 
Come on, Bauer. I know you can fly better than us. All right. Come on. We can do this. We can do this. I just need to get three close calls and not get it. Or, and not get hit. I almost had it once. Definitely wasn't that try. Did I break the music? Did the music break or what? I don't need to be that low. What if I go up? I push up, nothing happened. to go down. Okay. How about we just try avoiding this stuff instead? See what happens from here. Shut. You're better than this, buddy. Come on. He's going to try straight up. That, that wasn't a close call. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> 
Gotta at least get one more achievement. I don't care which one it is. How did I even hit that one? Top or do I want to be at the bottom? I didn't even hit it. I didn't hit it. Did I hit it? Miss that one. Miss that one. Yeah, I didn't even hit it. Bunch of bull. Today, Mr. Penguin. Whoa. Yeah, that one I legitimately hit. That one was like straight smack to the face. That might have been two. Might have been two. Chicken. Oh, broke music again. Try and that's it. I am stubborn. I'm not that stubborn. Okay, never mind. One more try. That was way too short. 54 meters. I just do this. What if I just like bob and weave? It doesn't work. <laughs> Definitely doesn't work. <laughs> that didn't work either. right off the bat. What was the other one? Control? Oh! I wonder if 
That's how it work. Slow mo, straight in. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna try something now. Just gonna fly straight. Yeah. No. Fly straight. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're good. Come on. Okay, there's two. I got this. I can do this. How did I not count? We don't have an extra. Alright, well that ain't gonna do me any good. So what's the intro? I am Bauer every day since I was Papa Dream one day of becoming the first mouse to ever fly a plane. Work on my dream day and night since I was old enough to hold a spanner. Today I finally finished building it. All I have to do now is learn how to fly, but how hard can it be? Well, when it says do not enter wrong way, whatever else said, probably not that great. Oh man. That, that, that is it. Okay. Um, well, that was game number two, at least, anyway. Um, Bauer ended up just turning into more of a achievement hunt than anything, because I have actually played that one before. Um, the first one, the smithing, whatever it was called. Smithworks. Um, that one I just downloaded today specifically for this video. So I do have two more. Um, I have Shadowverse and Split or Steel. Um, I think I'm probably gonna like do Shadowverse first. We'll do like an hour or so of that and then maybe like an hour of Split or Steel depending on how those go. Um, but before I get to those, I'm gonna take maybe like a five or 10 minute break, grab a snack, grab some more liquids other than, you know, coffee. And then we'll get to those two. Um, after that, I will probably end this stream. Let's see, what time is it getting me? Perfect. Uh, let's see, it's about six o'clock. So if I do an hour of each, or do like an hour of Shadowverse, maybe like half hour, 45 minutes or so, a split or steel, depending on how that, how that goes. After those two, I am probably going to end the stream and then uh, take a little break, eat some dinner, and then I will do my normal scheduled stream. So we're gonna have a little bit longer day today. But um, like I said, I'm going to take about like a five or 10 minute break or something, grab a snack, um, and then I will be back with um, Shadowverse, I think. Yeah, Shadowverse. So I will see you guys after just a little bit.
Alrighty, guys. I am back after a short little break here. Um, actually, I gotta do one more thing. This pillow is gonna come in nice and handy because the cushion on my chair absolutely sucks. So, for anyone that is still here or in here, um, I am on just chatting, but I am doing some Freebie Fridays. Um, and it's just a couple games that I have picked for technically yesterday, but um, I wasn't streaming yesterday. So I planned on doing a little bit longer stream today and uh, we'll do our Freebie Fridays today. So it became Freebie Saturdays or post Freebie Friday. Um, we just did Bauer and, um, and Smithworks. And I was going to change over to uh, Shadowverse and we'll try that out. So let me get that up and running here. And then I will switch my screen again. Let's see if it picks it up right away. Yep. English works for me. Okay. Let me change this. Okay, we're going to do that. Uh, well, obviously. Yep, it's fine with me. Really? Um, no. We're not. Do I have to do the tutorial? I do. Yeah, I guess. I don't want to have to do the tutorial. Maybe I should have done this, like, beforehand, but come on. Well, downloading data. Take longer to download data with poor signal. Well, obviously, but, I mean, it doesn't need to go this slow. Does it really need to go this slow? Should have checked this out beforehand. That way, you guys didn't have to sit here through the like data download. Come on, what is taking so long here? Well, let's read this in the meantime. Arissa. Arissa's training as a guardian of the forest. She is inseparable from her friend Losaria until one day a menacing creature appears in their path. Erica, sword wielding protector to the princess, she left the castle to investigate an infamous vampire's final resting place. Isabel, an alchemical researcher, tragic death of her beloved fiance made her obsessed with the idea of resurrecting the dead. Rowan, former commander in the royal army, his life changed when approached this dragon attacked his squad. Now, he is now trying to come to terms with the consequences. And Luna. Troubled child who lives in a dark, distant mansion. She finally decides to venture out into the world, hoping to find new playmates. You're a slash of vampires. If I have a choice to pick on who, I know who I'm picking already. Has been awakened after centuries. He yearns for another fight with his bitter rival, King Balthazar. 
Harris, High Priestess, who works tirelessly to cease the suffering of humanity. She continues to serve despite having lost her memories when a familiar face appears. And Yuan. As an aloof man who seeks vengeance against the being that destroyed his world, he joins those that have chosen the past, chosen to stand against Nexus to settle things between himself and the Keepers. Come on, downloading data. You're gonna, like, make me fall asleep here. Alright. Well, how about we do this in the meantime? Mm. Live mixer. I'm going to currently mute that for a minute. Check out the other one. Quality high. I'm gonna be end up picking here. That works for me. All right. So this is Splitter Steel. I might actually end up doing this first because uh, I gotta wait for the other stuff to download. So I have already linked my account and everything in here. Let's see. In each game, you'll be presented with a potential cash prize, tier two C two hundred. You win, you'll advance to the next game tier. You receive either a portion of or all of the potential cash prizes. You have two options in each game, split or steal. Once you've made your decision, you can lock in. Once both players have locked in or the timer runs out, both players will reveal their moves to each other. From here, the outcomes are simple. If both players split, you both win and share the reward. If one player splits and the other steals, then a thief wins, the splitter loses. If both players steal, then both players lose. Okay. Any coins you will win will remain on the coins outstanding pile. You cannot spend these coins until you cash out. If you are stolen from, you lose your entire coins outstanding pile. If you steal in a game, then half of the coins you steal will be transferred to your normal spendable coins balance. Okay. Be aware, while stealing nets you far more coins on average, it also binds you, brands you as a thief. You can lose this branding by cashing out or, or by surviving to the next round. Um... This real quick. Since I swapped, yeah, this one even on here. change of that. You have to join Q to match or to get matched up with a player in a similar tier to you. In each game you'll be, you'll be clearly shown your and your opponent's rewards for splitting and for stealing. Note that alongside coins there is also a karma value. Other players will be able to see your karma value in game. If your karma is low other players will know you often steal. If you plan on living the thief life you may want to find ways to balance out your karma. We know it's a big deal to text, so please ask in the in-game chat or on Discord if you need any help. For now, remember you hitting this button. For now, just remember you hitting this button to start matchmaking or join queue. 
and hit this to cash out your coins. Try to cash out 5,000 more or more to unlock your headquarters. Okay. Um, so what do we have here? Reflections, character music, sound effects, return. 25% coin, weekend, and... jump. I just want 5,000 coins, right? Is it gonna make me jump again? Nope. If it's standing, you're not an organization. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say that anybody that is playing us right now um, is probably doing the same thing that I'm doing, trying to get the 5,000 coins. So, let's go for another round. At least get enough that we can kind of like check out the headquarters or something. Outstanding. Ooh. Don't wanna risk it? Yeah, I'll risk it. Why not? Is that baffling bowfin? I wonder how many people are even actually like on here at the moment. Blissful Barneo. Take a chance and split it. So where am I at? 8,125? Oh boy. I want to go one more. Let's go one more. But 
Come on. Okay. I'm cashing out. So, headquarters? Of course, allows you to purchase buildings, which will give you bonuses to your play and allow you to generate coins and artifacts. Click any tile to purchase a building. Artifacts per day, point zero four zero four seventeen thousand two hundred and eighty seventeen QA twenty eight eight on the karma. I almost want to go with like expeditions so far. Hmm, maybe I should start with a police station. Good karma split bonus, three percent. I think I'm going to do a I'm going to do split. So I think what I'm going to do is what do we got? Police station, Carmel Bay, twenty-eight eight. Split bonus, ten percent. Oh, I think I'm going to get a police station. But we'll put it right here. Your new headquarter bonuses are now active. Your building also has a 25% bonus to its rewards, and it's the only one of its kind in your base. If your building awards coins or artifacts, they will now begin generating. If you've earned enough cash, you can also upgrade for larger bonuses. For now, though, let's claim your rewards. Okay. Vault will update every hour and rewards will be stored for 40 hours. Be sure to claim your rewards within that time. Artifacts provide a passive bonus to all of your in-game earnings. If you've been awarded one free artifact, try opening it now. Coin bonus, defense, attack bonus. Seems small now, but it scales without limit. You can earn more artifacts through your headquarters, cosmetics, and an organization. Includes a tutorial. Keep building your headquarters, upgrading, and creating new buildings is the quickest way to increase your earnings. So, what if I upgrade for five million? Okay. Um, um, okay. Joining an organization, great way to add multipliers to your winnings. Try to find a like minded organization, an organization which has worked together to increase their steel winnings would be pointless for someone who splits every game. If you can ask in global chat, in game, or on our Discord for any organizations which are recruiting, you can apply to an organization via either a short code or directly through your match history. Uh, okay, well, I'm not gonna do that at the moment. Let's check out this. What do we have for skins? Sixty, sixty. What, what's what's our most expensive one? Uh, 
That's just ridiculous. Isn't that the one? What is this? Ooh, that's like Tyriel. I am low dog. Paladin. Well, that's kind of cool. Arbiters, pretty much same thing, just a little bit different. Stealth splitter. I like the Cosmos Keeper. Not just like a litura. Destroyer of worlds. How oh, is that the destroyer of worlds? Alright, well how do I get out of here? Close score? Close store, not score. curious how these work like are these almost kind of seem like um like npcs like is, is this even like uh why people are actually playing like we're seeing last hour five Not a whole lot of people are playing this. And if so, what tier are they at? sure these are NPCs which I mean is whatever I'm gonna try and get, um, I think I'm gonna be playing like too much left of this, but. I a total of 15 games in order to unlock daily and weekly rankings. Okay, well, what am I at, 10?
won't take that anyway. Your daily rewards will increase every day that you play in a row. You won't lose your progress as long as you claim at least one reward in a day. Try to reach 40 rounds played in one day to unlock your daily artifact bonus. So, I mean, even with M NPCs or whatever, I'm still looking at like... 10 to 15 seconds in a match. Waiting to see just out of curiosity if I'm gonna actually see a normal player. Yeah, they're they're bots. High stakes. High stakes games are played through tiers eight, nine, and ten. Every game at this level will be considered high stakes. In a high stakes game, you will be given no information on your opponent. In turn, your opponent will receive no information on you. Uh, coin prizes are randomized between fifty thousand and five hundred thousand coins. If either player is at tier ten when matched, then the prize will be set to a minimum of ten or a hundred thousand coins. Once match has been completed, both players can see information on their opponent via the match history screen or on the main menu and engage in standard behavior such as viewing their opponent's organization or conducting a heist. I'm going to assume I'm still probably going to get NPCs. You're using default cosmetics, which may mark you as a new player or as an easy target for stealing in high stakes. Your 60,000 credits on us, try to open something different or some different skins or lighting before proceeding. Um, and then check out lighting. lights on me. There's just a lot of flags. And not really particularly too interested in the lights because they're just gonna eh. Let's unlock after opening 10 artifacts. Unlock artifacts for your headquarters, daily rewards, okay. So we'll get through, um, I think tier 10, so we can get out of the high stakes. And then I'm going to cash out and That's one. 
Another bot. Congratulations on beating tier 10. Your coins have been automatically cashed out. Oh, okay. And are now available to spend. You want a total of 327,795 coins, plus anything extra that you stole from earlier rounds. Uh, if you had a doubler, you'd have won 655,590. What's the doubler? Nope. Check out rankings. All users and organizations are entered in daily weekly rankings. Winners earning prizes each night. Try flipping between the categories to see where you currently stand. Remember that your ranking only updates once every hour. Wow. Bag of Badgers. Interesting. 808 artifacts earned yesterday or daily. Wow, flower. Okay, so I'm curious. Just what happens if you were to steal against a bot? We have 568,000. If I just, if I wanted to steal, are they going to do the same thing that I am? Okay, so bot is gonna do pretty much the same decision that you're going to. Headquarters, what do I need? 50,000 for another thing? My global offices. Um, that's what else do I need for upgrade? That was 5 million. That ain't gonna happen. One the same? Yes. So, how much to build another one? Another 50,000. Yeah, 518. Which one gives me the most artifacts starting? We'll do a museum over here. Um, the museum on the side. Ship right now, though. Nineteen. Okay, I'm at the point where I need two hundred fifty thousand.
Okay, so if I want to do this again, I'm pretty much going to have to just split it every single time. Unless I actually come across a new player. Or, not a new player. Um, just somebody else that's playing. So, that ain't really going to work. I guess we are going to. I'm going to switch over to this for now, and I'm going to check on. And the game is at 78% right now. What am I wrong? Wrong keyboard. Okay, temporarily back to just chatting. While I wait for this, this is at eighty uh, percent right now. Let that go just for a little bit here. I am going to have to wait on that one. Oh yeah, 95%. Oh, now you're getting faster. Okay, come on. 98%. And then just like straight dead stop. Some of these games just, just, come on. You have an issue? Exactly, am I waiting for? Oh, 
Oh, perfect. Okay, we're in now. Okay, let me change this real quick. presence has filled the sky as people know it by one name, the Morning Star. It is a promise of freedom, a glimpse of new worlds, a light reaching into oblivion, a shadow in mortal hearts. When darkness covers the world, the gates of annihilation will open. I forgot to turn music back on. Prologue. Osaria and Arissa are two young elves who live in the woods. They are training tirelessly one day to one day become forest guardians. Whoa! You always do so great, Losaria. Me? I never ever hit like this. Sure you do. You're trying really hard, Arisa. Well, yeah. If I don't try my hardest, how else am I supposed to pass the trials with you? Good point. If anyone can do that, it's you. We'll both be forest guardians. Yeah. Thank you, Lasaria. Oh. Ooh, the darkness huh? has started. The forest is scared. Save you. Ooh, there be trouble brewing in the forest. Uh, let's see. Battle animation settings, game settings will be adjusted for optimal play on your device. Well, I'm on PC, so I think I should be fine. Out of my way! Cards can be played by spending play points. Drag goblin from your hand to your area. Goblin's feeling hungry. Okay. Regular follow cards aren't a can't attack on the turn they're played. That's normal. You can attack by dragging your follower onto an enemy. Drag your goblin toward the enemy fairy to attack. Uh, attack is on the left. Defense is on the right. I like heavy that. So every turn you gain an additional play point orb, and all empty orbs are refilled. You now have two play points. Play the fighter you drew. I live by the sword. This is my my defense apparently doesn't go back up. Probably gonna attack this one. You can choose to attack the enemy leader even if they have a follower in their area. I like give me that. How to take that? How much is in it for me? Doesn't quite make any sense. Though. Oh, yeah, no. Um, yeah. Take that. Fall back. I like. Give me that. Iron my fair share. 
That looks hard, man. That one's gonna take five, so that one's gonna be next one. Ooh, throwing off the big boy. Make one follower per turn even stronger by evolving it. What if I want the Angelic Sword Maiden? They're not gonna let me though. Okay. You're done for. Ooh. Well, followers can immediately attack enemy followers even on the same turn they played hand. Who goes first can evolve twice per battle. Second player can evolve three times. Ooh. Now attack the enemy leader win this battle. I like to be Earn my fair share. I want to do the angelic sword maiden though. As the two young girls are training, a mysterious creature snatches Arissa away. Lasaria chases after the creature to save Arissa. I guess I should have put, um... There. We'll come back to us. Out of my way. Is there going to be any more tutorials? So far we've been using follower cards. They can attack enemies, defend against enemy attacks, and be evolved. I mm -hmm. live by the sword! So what are you going to teach me now? Attack the enemy leader with your fighter. Take that. Okay. Well, of Destiny's amulet strengthens one of your followers at the start of the turn. Okay, plus one, plus one to a random allied. One of my followers, amulets can't attack or defend it since they, instead they have powerful abilities that affect other cards and leaders. Can they be destroyed? Revenge. Some cards have special abilities that activate under certain conditions. Fanfare abilities trigger when the card is played from hand. You won't escape. One damage to a random enemy follower. Crackers fanfare dealt damage to the enemy Goblin King. Now attack the Goblin King. Take that! Darn it all! All their cards that activate their ability immediately and and are then discarded. This card damages the enemy, then gives you a fairy card too. Destroy Lizardman now. Evolve your elf tractor. Defeat your opponent. You can also use the yellow sphere to evolve cards. You're done for. My arrows never miss. This'll do it! Works for me. Any other tutorials? Yes, we'll just, we'll just enable voice. Out of my way. Uh, okay. Keep low cost cards that can be played in early rounds of battle. Replace expensive cards that won't be playable until later on. It just. I 
just doesn't like me having what I have. Three defense. The forest abandoned me. How much is in it for me? But the forest. Better than in the cradle. Hmm. I like color from the play again. Plus one, plus zero. again that looks sword maiden can I actually put that one down now why would I have I do have five Let's see five six what is gonna be five six four four um I live by the sword It won't be long now. I faith in my blade and take that. Defend the forest. One, two, three, four. This calls for a celebration. Wait, that's it? That's fine. Six elf tracker. You won't escape. But the forest. It ends here. My arrows never miss. Yeah, yeah. This will do it. This will do oh, it. Oh, I can. Oh, okay. I can attack followers, but I can't attack. Trying to make me follower do this two times. Are you gonna get spread my piddly little things or? How much is in it for me? Fine with me. This wasn't worth it. How much is in it for me? This will do it. You be done. You earned rewards. Collect them later from the crate in the home screen. Okay. I think I'll probably go to the home screen and check that out.
Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Thanks. I thought something might have happened to you. I'm glad you're safe. There's another one. Of course, there. It's not just gonna be one. Come on. Arissa, be careful. Losaria, <laughs> Losaria, wait. What does she have against her? Where are they taking you? No. What am I gonna do? Snap out of it. Losaria needs you. Hold on, Losaria. Mm hmm. More. Well. I thought that was supposed to be... Ultimate Bahamut. Ooh, 13-13. With Accelerate? Deal 3 damage to a random enemy follower. Put an Ultimate Bahamut into your deck. Recover 4 play points. At the end of your turn, if you use at least 50 play points this match, invoke this card, then banish cards from your opponent's deck until there are 5 cards left. What else we got? Shining Valkyrie, Unevolve 2 5, Storm Fanfare. Put two fairies into your hand, give them the following effect. Deal 3 damage to a random enemy follower, gain plus 1 plus 0 for every two allied fairies in play or in your hand. Evolved has Storm. Legendary Sword Commander. On legendary sword, while well, any ally legendary swords in play, this follower has rush. Affected by other cards, effect is still those that change the card attack or defense, same as unevolved, excluding fanfare. Spell you play this turn, deal 20 damage to enemy leader. That ain't too bad for a spellcaster deck. You can cost all spells in your hand that originally cost 3 play points or less to 0. I replay a spell, if it's 7 spell you play this turn, deal 20 damage to enemy leader. Infinite Flame Dragon Fanfare. Your X equals this follower's attack. Randomly summon copies of allied shadowcraft followers to different costs. Destroy this match, exclude any part of soul taker until your area is full. Give them last words, summon a copy of this follower. Fusion Bloodcraft. Whenever cards are fused to this card, change this card's cost to 6. Well, leader takes 4 more damage, restore 4 defense to your leader, and deal 4 damage to this follower. Password summon an Imperial Saint and evolve it. Storm Bane and Ward when it's evolved. Cool. What time are we looking at? We're at about 7.10. I think while this is downloading... I am going to end the stream right here. Um, I gotta grab some food. I'm starting to get really hungry. Um, I plan on being back, hopefully within like the next hour-ish, because um, 
Let me set up my go grab food. I gotta run into town. Do a couple things in there real quick. Um, hopefully I'll be back for my scheduled, what do you mean, connection error? Let's go back to the title for now. But I will be back shortly. Um, for now I was just doing the free games. I'm going to plan on something else for like the main stream. Maybe I'll see if uh, one of my buddies is online. We can do some multiplayer something or other since it is Saturday night. But he does have to work. So we'll see how that goes. I'll figure something out. Either way, I am out of here for a little bit. I will see you guys after a little bit. Thank you guys for watching.